Tiger Woods is trending on Twitter today because of some comments he made regarding President Donald Trump. The statement being, He's the President of the United States. You have to respect the office. No matter who's in the office, you may like, dislike, personality, or the politics, but we all must respect the office. And people are pissed. Here are some of the tweets. LB4 Wakanda says, What the fuck? Is Tiger Woods being the golf version of Kanye West Coonan? Hope not. That will be one less sport I'll be watching. Charities Closetville says, He's an Uncle Tom and forgets what color he is, and if the KKK was lynching minorities, they would be after his ass too. Not a good look, Tiger Woods. There's also a snippet of some ESPN reporter, Max Kellerman, going around of him calling Tiger Woods stupid for the comments he made. Basically saying, oh, you're saying we have to respect anybody who's in office, no matter who they are or how evil they are. If Charles Manson is in the Oval Office, we still have to respect him. Which is obviously not what he's saying. Tiger Woods is saying the same thing that Dave Rubin and Joe Rogan are saying, which is that, look, Donald Trump's in charge. Whether or not you like him, you should want him to do a good job. But all of these comments about Butter Biscuits and Uncle Tom are so annoying. You're seeing it right now with Tiger Woods, but I see it all the time with Roman Millennial, Hi I Think I'm Real, Chris Raygun, essentially saying that because they're people of color and they're not arguing in favor of their race that they're brainwashed or whitewashed. Just because we would rather talk about principles and not inconsequential, non-essential, irrelevant shit like race. These are all people that I've met, by the way, and talked to at length. Me and Romy Millennial were up for hours one night talking, and you know what never came up? What it's like to grow up as a young Asian woman. Because it's not interesting. We talked about relationships, and we talked about philosophy, things that are important to us. Same thing with real. We didn't talk about what it's like to be Mexican. We talked about taxes for hours. I spent almost an entire week with Bunty King, and I still have no idea what, it, what his actual race is. Because it didn't come up, we had more interesting things to talk about. So, no, Tiger Woods is not some butter biscuit eating Uncle Tom traitor just because he doesn't want to harangue Donald Trump like everybody else. I imagine he's not very interested in talking about politics at all, considering how rarely he comes up in the political conversation. He's an athlete. He wants to talk about things that are important to him. He wants to talk about golf. And I'd much rather talk to people about things that are important to them. And if race is something that's important to you, I'm probably not going to want to talk to you because I can't imagine you have a lot of very interesting things to say. And overall, I'm just not impressed with the people who make these kinds of comments about minorities who would rather talk about things that are important important to them and principles rather than something completely irrelevant. Anyway, there you go. That's a video. Thank you guys for watching. Bye, 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 bye. Bye.